to my channel. So today I am basically going to take a ride to Target and Trader Joe. Um, my daughter's with my mom, so I decided to take advantage and do a little shopping. I'm gonna see what full decor they have. I also have to pick up a few things. Um, I have a list on my phone. I need to pick up some groceries at Trader Joe and I wanted to check out some of the fall decor um, for the upcoming season so I thought I'd take you along. Alright, let's get going. Yesterday, I actually had the pumpkin cold brew, which was totally amazing. And today, I am back to an oldie, which is the pumpkin spice latte. Yum. <laughs> I would do a small Trader Joe haul since I didn't really get a chance to record in there um so just some things that we like uh, I really like the chicken fried rice um, it's quick and easy for dinner some bananas this is my favorite uh, coffee to drink iced um, I keep it in the fridge obviously and then I just add in my almond milk and it is so good then I like um, Ross um, slivered almonds, excuse me, for my overnight oats when I go back to work, because I'm going back to work. Then I got some chocolatey coated chocolate chip dunkers for snacks for my husband and I. Um, got some organic reduced sugar blueberry preserves, just because I like to sometimes have that on a bagel or waffle or whatever. Got some cheese sticks, got our favorite, favorite ice cream. This is so good. If you have not tried it, you need to run to your local Trader Joe and get these because they are delicious and I could definitely eat like two, but I don't. I usually always have one and um, no, they're just so good. I love them. Then I saw that they had figs, so I really like figs. So I picked up a big box of figs. Then I am going to set up my classroom tomorrow and Friday, so I'm going to need to pack lunch. So I just got myself a turkey club wrap, and it has some turkey spinach, uncured turkey, bacon with a creamy tomato dressing and a tomato tortilla. And then I got myself a classic Caesar. And then also what we like to have is this tempura cauliflower. Um, it's really good. The sauce is kind of spicy, so I would recommend if you don't like spicy food not to use the entire pouch of the sauce you can even have it without the sauce but um i like to use about half of the pouch in the oven and it is delicious so that is my small trader haul trader i'm sorry trader joe's haul okay guys so now i'm going to uh just quickly show you what i got from target and um they had a really nice selection today but of course i didn't want to go too crazy because every time i step into target i get lost in there and then i end up going to the cash register and wondering why my bill is like 300 dollars. so 
I limited myself, got some things that we needed and walked out of there. I think I was in there for a total of like 20 minutes and I walked out with like four bags. So um, first thing I got was a soda stream refill because my husband and I like the, we have a soda stream machine and we like seltzer. My husband especially likes seltzer. So we had to get a refill of that. And then I got some flavored drops. I got the lime drops and then I got the uh, lemon drops and these were on sale. Good old toothpaste, some pebbles for um, laundry. I actually just redid my laundry room, so I kind of enjoy buying laundry <laughs> things like detergent and pebbles because I could put it into the cute little containers that I uh, put it in now. So got some seventh generation laundry detergent. I um, recently had well not recently i did get my last detergent from grove collaborative and i uh, was going to wait to place an order with them but we're running really low on detergent so i just got it in store got some organic marinara sauce so i can make some pasta for my daughter as well as some organic elbow pasta and then I got her, so I really like the Art Class brand at Target as well as the um, Cat and Jack. I think that's what's called, Cat and Jack. So I just picked up this little cute cardigan for her. She's starting daycare tomorrow. I'm so sad about that. Two days a week and um, I feel like she can, I could just throw this on on top of like a cute little dress or something just to keep her extra warm when it gets cold. Then I got her some pajamas because she is a year old, but she outgrew like all her onesies. So I'm now on 18 month old clothes. So this was only $11. So I thought it was really cute. Um, it's like a, a t-shirt with shorts. And then it says time for a cat nap, short sleeve top with pants that um, I can send to daycare. She could wear them around the house. And then I also got her because she is obsessed with Paw Patrol. Um, and when I saw this, I was like, yes, have to have it, picking it up. And they had a Paw Patrol pajama set. How freaking cute is this? So it says tap pups and it's a long sleeve set and then another long sleeve set. And this was $17. And then I got myself that dress that I think I showed, I recorded, um, the maxi dress. I thought it was really cute with a belt. Um, I could wear it to work. And then I just recently, after I actually redid the closet in our bedroom, I realized that I had a lot of mismatched old pajamas. So I was like, I need to stock up on some really cute pajama sets because that's what I really like to wear. So I got this because I've been seeing this. It's a leopard pajama top, and then it comes with the shorts. I don't know if you could see it, there's shorts here. So something I could wear now and then transition the top into the winter because I picked up the pants too. And I thought they were really cute. And the little strings have like little pom-poms on them. So I thought that would be really cute to wear with the top when it gets a little chilly and to wear with the shorts when it's like really warm. Okay, so that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.